very warm welcome to you on uh, this most pleasantly clear evening. As you can see, we are getting through the uh, pre-match formalities and processes, the uh, players coming onto the field for the usual fanfare and handshakes and so on. Conditions absolutely perfect. Temperatures are kind enough. It is an absolute picture under the floodlights here. And the match that follows ought to follow suit. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Well, it's a tough one, but I'll go for Danny Alves, just to point out that he masquerades as a fullback. He has spent so much of the game deep in opposition territory, playing like a winger. Tremendous fitness and athleticism, and that enables him to, uh, to perform this way. Uh, the scourge of so many strikers. So it's away we go then. Gabriel Jesus. And sprayed out wide. Cristiano Ronaldo. Now Cristiano Ronaldo! That's gone a long way up and away. for a throw-in. Firmly met. Philippe Coutinho. Pushes it out wide. Looking to break out here. Marquinhos. There's a lot of movement up front. Yeah, I've noticed that those uh, front players are working very hard, dropping deeper. Yeah, and I just think it keeps the opposition off guard with, with so much switching of position. Keeping shape is, is much harder. Felipe. It'll be a throw-in. Gets it back. Alan. Gabriel Jesus. Field. Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, good interception. Philippe Coutinho. The other side yet able to force a breakthrough here. And that's a throw. Marquinhos battles to win it back. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Peru have it back and they can go again. Guerrero. Cristiano Ronaldo! It's there! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. So we have our breakthrough. Look, he's the one everyone expects to put the ball in the net. That's what he's paid to do. Loose. Forward it goes. Plays it out to the wing. It's a decent ball. Cristiano Ronaldo! Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. The timing of the pass and run was exquisite.
challenge. He just stood firm. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! That is a great ball, but not a great... Alan. Hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1-0. Slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Brazil just had to make the ball stick, but came up short. And he just whacks it away. And the ball's come loose, and the chase is had a shot. Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Weather sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Felipe Luis needed to come up with a better ball. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. There's the whistle for half-time. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. And we're off again. Peru carrying a one-goal lead. Done very well to intervene. And he's onside. Towering header. Really well taken goal. Two to the good. They have breathing space. Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Well, it's an inspired substitution. Terrific move by the boss. And that's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect. What an introduction. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Keeper's got good distance on that. Neymar plays it out to the flank. And back to base. Keeper goes long. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Philippe Coutinho. Keeper's got good distance on that. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Tries to get it forward quickly. Gets wrestled off the ball. Philippe Coutinho. Neymar, he's got away. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Has a shot! Aimed long and direct. And it's Felipe. Now it's Neymar. Can he score? That's a half-decent try. Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Has he found his man? Out to the left it goes. Danny Alvec. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Danny Alves clearly cannot believe it, but he is off. And they're going to have to find a way without him. Forward it goes. Strong punch. Cleared without complication. No, no way through there. Well played, he saw that coming. He's on the back foot. Tries to get it forward quickly. Carillo. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. 
could move up a gear here. And that has been clubbed away. Aimed long and direct. Alinho gets good distance on it. Felipe Luis with the slide tackle there. And now the Cristiano Ronaldo! And it's there! And the lead is three! It is surely done! Peru take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Now it's Neymar. That's lovely. He's left his man. And it's got through. Farfan. Cristiano Ronaldo. Defending was physical, no nonsense, and it had to be. Well positioned to make that interception. And it's Felipe. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And that's that. A demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking?